Hello everyone, welcome to another Blu-ray unboxing video. Today we have a 4K release for Boz Lerman's Elvis. I will be giving away the digital copy. If you'd like to win it, just follow these instructions on the screen. And guys, this was a very good movie. Um, I saw it a couple months ago in theaters. I did a review, if you want to go back and look at it. Um, I gave the movie like an 8 out of 10, I believe. Um, only seen it once, obviously. But yeah, it was very good. Um, not excellent per se but it definitely you know i'm sure for some people it was probably excellent um this does have dolby vision and atmos so that's going to look very good uh on this release because this movie is very very visual um a lot going on on the screen um but yeah a nice slip cover here nice uh reflective shiny uh looking slip cover here um different artwork from the standard blu-ray which is nice um this didn't get a steelbook unfortunately i was figuring this would get one um, especially with this kind of, you know, movie. Um, but it's whatever. I'll accept the, uh, you know, this is a very nice slipcover here, so I'm fine with it. Um, we have Austin Butler here, of course, who played Elvis in the movie. Absolutely killed it. Would not be surprised if he, uh, won, you know, uh, the Oscar for this movie. I'm sure, th there's, I'm, I'm 100% sure he's gonna get nominated, um, at least. Um, Tom Hanks was in there as well. Uh, you do get a bunch of features here, which is very nice. Um... Yeah, guys, Austin Butler just, like, totally transformed himself for this movie. Um, but, yeah, like I said, very good. 8 out of 10 for me. Uh, not the film of the year, per se. For me, it's still Top Gun, and I don't know why Top Gun's taking so long to come out on Blu-ray. I think we have to wait till November for that. Um, <laughs> I really want Top Gun. Um, but, yeah, here on the back, you know, slightly different um, artwork from the uh, slipcover. So taking the plastic off, again, this is just a standard 4K case right here, nothing too fancy. So let's open this up, not show the code. Oh, okay, so you open it up, you get some sort of a Graceland advertisement. Mine's all beat up for some reason. Um, the 4K is a red disc right there. So taking the inserts out. So first we get the Graceland advertisement, like I said, on the back side. Um, you get a picture of what it looks like inside, right there. And I instantly think of uh, Zombieland Double Tap because they actually went there. Um, <laughs> I assume they, like, you know, it was a set. It wasn't the actual Graceland. Um, so that's pretty cool. Like I said, I don't know why mine is so beat up like that, but whatever. So if you want to pause and read any of that right there, go ahead. Feel free to. Um, the digital copy paper looks just like this. Same picture right there. And then on the back, um, we get some other Warner Brothers titles right there. Three for $15. It's not a bad deal, I guess. All right, and then the uh, inside of the case, we have um, kind of a yellowish, like a tannish yellow kind of color here on the Blu-ray, which is nice. Um, but yeah, nothing nothing else going on here. Like I said, this is just a standard 4K release with the slipcover. Um, really wanted this one to have a steelbook, but it's okay. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna complain about it. Um, but yeah, very nice. This this is definitely one of the coolest slipcovers like I have. Like I like too. Like you know, on the actual outfit here, like it's reflective. You know, um, very nice. So that's it, guys. That's Elvis. Let me know what you thought of the film in the comments. Um, do you think this is the best interpretation of Elvis on film yet? I know they John Carpenter made one with Kurt Russell a long time ago, and I'm sure there's been other versions. But uh, this is the only one I've seen, and, you know, I really liked it, obviously. So, um, But that's it, guys. Thank you guys for watching this one, and have a good one. Bye-bye.